Agora TV. The world is thinking. So what are some examples of places where technology has made a big difference in, uh, in uh, user behavior? One of them is open source. And uh, for those of you who are not aware, open source has been a system that really was uh, uh, enabled by the internet where thousands of programmers all over the world contribute code that have created enormous systems. The Linux operating system as one example, the uh, Apache web serving system, the MySQL relational database system that are now the foundation blocks for companies, uh, both commercial companies and universities and institutions. So we think open source is a very powerful, very effective way of enabling changes in behavior. And so we're bringing open source to uh, home energy efficiency and, and, the, and the, uh, the smart grid. We are providing an open source stack and uh, we have announced a, a device that's basically a chip with a radio and an open source software stack that anyone can take and put into their devices, into their appliances, onto their sprinkler systems. Uh, so everyone from the home hobbyist to the biggest multinational company can embed this open source home area network or ocean. And we believe this will be the springboard to enable other companies, other people, other developers, whether they're in academia or in industry, to create the types of novel and innovative creative technologies that will result in uh, significant energy savings. So really what we see is enabling an open source community that creates an internet of things. And uh, a number of people have talked about the internet of things where really any device, any appliance will be able to communicate through a, t a small chip and a radio uh, to the internet and from that to a web service or a mobile device which will allow you to monitor, view, analyze and uh, eventually control those activities. And if we think about this as a whole community uh, type of an environment, it really gets to community wellness. If you have information like this, you can determine whether it's more cost effective to turn down your thermostat or more cost effective to not drive into work on a particular day. So if it's, if it's, a, if it's a warm day, you may want to walk into work but keep your air conditioning up because your overall energy savings will be greater in that way. So we're thinking of this from a, from a much more holistic uh, point of view than just the specific energy savings of a particular device or a particular appliance. 